This is Shirley. <laughs> this is Shirley from Alaska, the Herb Lady. Today I'm talking on cardio assurance. Cardio assurance, I have used it on a lot of people after they, especially if they say they have high blood pressure, because it cardio assurance works on the veins and the arteries around the heart. Now we have blood pressure X that um, the doctor Files he put together. Uh, he was a chemist for 20 years. I sat under him, and he put both of these together, and they worked together, and he was a great guy, but he had bad health, and he came to uh, Tenacious Sunshine, and he started using their herbs, and he said, oh, I know, I know how to do this, I know how, and he knew the chemical, that, by chemical, but what he did, he, he took the chemical from the herb, I put the whole herb in there and started using it, and we've seen some great results from the stuff he put together. So he put this cardio assurance. It's the leading cause in the U.S. is heart disease. Uh, cardio assurance offers a powerful blend of ingredients of Hawthorne that shows to reduce the risk of heart disease and helps prevent circulatory disorders. The herbs are essential in cardio assurance that helps to protect the heart and blood from damaging the heart function and reduce blood pressure and cholesterol and lowers homocysteine. The first ingredient is a vitamin B6. It helps metabolism uh, and it's amino acid. A study reported that in the Journal of American uh, that if you take 400 mcgs of folic acid it prevents cor coronary heart disease in a woman as quitting smoking reduce blood pressure and lowers uh, lowers cholesterol research indicates that the supplement of all three b vitamins folic acid b6 and b12 has been shown to lower homocysteine levels increasing the risk of cardio assurance heart trouble and shows to reduce the blood pressure. Now the second one is B12 and B12 uh, recycles back into the metabolism and is essential for amino acids. It's an essential amino acid and a four-year study found the diet reflects a higher intake of folic acid B12 associated with lower numbers from the heart. B12 deficiency is associated with death from the left ventricle fraction. A single pumping ability of the left lower chamber of the heart which can be, lead to a development of congestion heart. The third one is folic acid. Now when I was reading this I really was surprised what they, what they, their research showed in folic acid. It's one of the main ones. So me and my husband started taking it. Folic acid has been shown to provide cardio protection. Most important, folic acid decreases blood levels of the amino acid homocysteine, which can damage the lining of the arteries and, and blood clotting. Stud studies have shown that between the homocysteine level and the risk of coronary heart disease, uh, heart attacks and the risks were three times higher in men. It appears that the higher homocysteine level can be reduced by a supplement folic uh, acid along with vitamin 12 and B12 and B6, which is turned to help to prevent and slow and even stop the prog progression of heart disease. In fact, research on this is what I was surprised suggests that folic acid may be the most important single nutrition to provide protection for your heart. Research estimated 13,500 deaths from heart disease are common for congestion, heart failure, lack of folic acid. And the fourth one is vitamin K. And vitamin K, if you don't have candida and if you don't eat sugar and you don't take antibiotics, your body makes K vitamin K in the small intestine and the large intestine. Vitamin K is fat-soluble in human, and it's 
in the gastro health track, and it's a negative uh, bacteria. Vitamin K also is naturally both planted and fermented in, in plants and fermented food. Ja in NATO, Japanese fermented soy food, uh, it's a diet source of vitamin K. Vitamin K is essential for formation and a chemical required for blood clotting. The stoppage of bleeding and hemorrhaging, vitamin K deficiency can be abnormal blood clotting and blood tendency. Vitamin K is an important factor of production of proteins that inhibits calcification and process where the calcium is deposited on the veins of the walls. The evidence indicates that very low vitamin K, K intake and associated increased risk of heart disease and death. Vitamin K deficiency is common in individuals with celiac disease, with spruce and colitis, which all results in the intestinal metabolism of nutrition of vitamin K deficiency can be caused by the inaccurate sorts duct of deficiency of bile. So you also need your bile from your gallbladder. Now, a lot of people don't know this, but in the research it says aspirin use, radiation, x-ray, industrial po uh, pollution, rancid fat, like if you fry bacon and you use rancid fat, any kind of fat like that, when you fry it and stick it. We used to do it by the gallons. We used to do it when I was a kid. Mom would put rancid fat in everything. Uh, it destroys your vitamin K. Well, excess antibodies can destroy the intestinal and produces, that produces vitamin K. Okay, the fifth ingredient is Hawthorne Berry. It was God is one of the most definite herb for the heart disease in the Western medicine is widely used in Europe. Hawthorne Berry helps reduce blood pressure, cholesterol, and improves blood flow, oxygen to the heart and enhances the heart muscle contraction to improve cardio efficiency. Hawthorne Berry also provides a heart protection uh, ability to decrease the oxygen demands on the heart tissues. Hawthorne Berry can be used to stabilize angina to slow the progress of patients stage two heart failures. And number six is resveratrol. It's a compound by plants. It helps to, uh, it's rich uh, source is found in grapes, wine, but, it, but it's mostly found in dried roots. Research has confronted that the ability of resveratrol, including the role of antioxidant, antiplatelets, anti-inflammation, studies have found that resveratrol inhibits the formation of blood clots and can lead to a heart attack and stroke. Also, in cholesterol metabolism, which helps prevent the formation, buildup, and plaque deposit in the arteries. I hope you learned something about cardio assurance. It's really a good product. It's got all the stuff. It's got zinc and it. it's got B12. It's got B12, B12, B6. And it's really, really good for you, especially around the veins and for your heart. So remember, you still live till your heart quits working and you're not alive no more. So I would challenge you to keep that heart healthy. Have a great day.